Hey, how's it going, homebrewers of YouTube? Uh, I wanted to shoot a video here and show you guys. Um, get a lot of questions about rousing yeast. Uh, people asking how I rouse my yeast um, because their attenuation hasn't um, attenuated, I guess would be the word, all the way out to where it should be. So, I'm going to show you guys what I do. Um, as you can see, there's the brew balls in there and there's one left so that's the point 1.005 is the one that's left in there so this should be attenuated pretty good um, like I said before I don't know how accurate they are this is the third time I've used them so I'll find out when I do a hydrometer reading this beer is about to be um, secondary so I'm gonna go ahead and just rouse the yeast just to show you guys what I do so I have a bucket star sand next to me and I take just my paddle and I turn it upside down and I'm dripping all over the place so. get as much of the stars in off as I can all right pull out the airlock sit it down there okay now I just take this and set it down on the bottom and now what we're trying to do, I'm sure you can see it there, is just lightly stir up the yeast on the bottom. Uh, you don't want to go real fast because you don't want to uh, introduce any oxygen back into the beer. So in the beginning oxygen is good, uh, after fermentation the oxygen is bad. see it. You're going to see some big white balls in there. Once again, that's the brew balls. All I'm doing is getting the yeast back up off the bottom. Back in the beer. That's it. I mean, you're just moving real slow and lightly stirring everything up so I hope that helps you guys out um, if you have any more questions about it just go ahead and ask and uh, I'll gladly answer them um, as quickly as I possibly can that beer smells really good this is my you know, that's the bad thing about better bottles they Create like a suction. Can't move them around or anything with the with the airlock on them. Um, but anyway, uh, any questions at all about it? Just ask. Uh, that's what I do. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching.